I scheduled a meeting with Z's daughter this morning to discuss my joint business proposal. If I can get her to agree, I'll be able to ship drugs to Duda and his crew over in LC. That'll bring in massive income and change our lives forever. See, being on this island got me thinking bigger than rap. I want everything this life has to offer, and I'm willing to do anything to get it. Well, good morning. Thank you so much for taking this meeting with me. Since being here on the island, I've become inspired by your family's operation, and I was just wanting to speak to you about setting up my own sub operation. See, I have family that lives in LC that I would trust for my life, and I believe tapping into that market could bring in substantial amounts of cash flow into your already growing enterprise. You know, I like your drive and obsession for wanting more in life. You remind me of myself in that way. Come, take a walk. Such a beautiful animal, is she not? Cash, listen. If I make my family vulnerable to you again, know that this is your last chance and there will be no room for error. Trust me, Kitty here loves the taste of a good fuck up. <laughs> I'll leave you two alone a moment. Zami, you're a genius! So I was able to get Catalina to put me in charge of distribution. Now she hasn't quite agreed to allow me to expand to LC just yet, but I think that's on the horizon. See, there's a huge shipment going out tonight. And if y'all go ahead and smack that like button, I'll bring you along with me. Now I read most of the comments and for the most part, everybody said, don't touch Z's daughter. Originally, I thought y'all was just being scary. But after she showed me that big ass lion, I was like, shit. Bro, it's cash. Can you talk? Yo, what's the word, nigga? Bro, I got an opportunity that has a lot of risk, but a lot of rewards, bro. You think your team can handle it? Hell yeah, we can handle that. All right, say less. We ain't gonna do too much talking on the phone. I'll get back with you shortly with the details. All right, bro, just get up with me then, bro. Just let me know what's going on. Yes! Sarsky PFG family, man, we are finally back with another dope ass video. Like always, go ahead and smack that subscribe button if you haven't already. And don't forget to like the video on the way in. Man, I want to go ahead and start off by giving a huge shout out to my boy Zavi. He is actually the one that provides most of the uh, instrumentals that we use on the channel. So if you guys are actually interested in any of the instrumentals, um, head over to his YouTube channel. He has a whole bunch of them on there for free. Um, the link will be in the video description. Uh, next, I want to go ahead and give a shout out to you guys, man. You guys have definitely been holding down the channel, man. I definitely, definitely appreciate it. Um, I see the ad squad is in full effect, man. That means so much that you guys, you know, click on the video and actually support me by watching the ads, man. That's that's like, bro, that, that's that's crazy, man. I really, really appreciate that. The the channel success to me is still pretty unreal, being that it, you know, it blew up so fast, but we are still grinding. Um, my new goal, I guess the current channel goal is to basically hit um, 80,000 or more subscribers by uh, by next month. Man, I'm not even going to put no date on it because I don't want to start focusing on it. You know, it was a while. It was a, a time when I was just focusing on, you know, getting to this number and getting there, getting there, getting there, getting there. And I think it kind of started to take away from the 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 channel. So I don't want to do that. But yeah, I'm just trying to hit 80,000 subscribers by next month. I'm sure we're going to do it. As a matter of fact, I know we're going to do it. So yeah man so thank you guys so much for all the love and support but right now we are on our way to one of the warehouse one of the family's warehouses um tonight we actually have a huge 
like a huge shipment bro oh i think i may have did i take the no okay we're going the right way yeah so tonight we have a huge shipment um and now that i am in charge of distribution it's a must that i be there now normally i don't think i'm gonna go along you know like actually go like travel with the shipment but i think tonight we may do that since it is our first time so yeah we are on our way to our warehouse so i'm thinking that catalina is actually using this shipment as oh it's getting dark as hell uh using this shipment as a um like a trial you know like basically like a, a trial and error to see how i do and hopefully if everything goes smooth and 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 how it's supposed to she'll let us expand to lc that way we can start flooding lc with all type of drugs and stuff and you know set set duda up and charge over there so guys uh, let's go ahead and get straight to it i'm gonna head inside get everything together Since I've been out the country, I've heard things have only gotten worse in the set. Knocking off OG Percy caused a lot of infighting, and the homies begin to target each other. With all the bloodshed in the streets, the police had no choice but to raid the entire hood, blocking everybody up. I feel partially responsible because it was my call to kill that bastard Percy. See, initially I felt like he was no good for the hood, but now I see he played a major role in keeping the peace. The state prosecutor is going before the judge today to present enough evidence to bring down the entire set. Included in that evidence is surveillance footage from the night we executed Percy. If I can retrieve that evidence, I can regain my freedom. All right, y'all, so we are on the way to do some grade A nut shit, man, bro. We got to knock off this prosecutor. <sighs> I, I mean, it is pretty stupid, but I feel partially responsible. Well, I can't even say partially. I guess I'm fully responsible for all the nonsense that's been going on in the hood since we fled the country and actually you know what i'm putting this on y'all man y'all was the main ones telling me to kill percy and i guess he played a bigger part than i you know initially had had you know thought basically so yeah i'm definitely putting this on y'all so we are actually on our way to knock off this uh prosecutor and by doing so we'll be able to collect the evidence bruh the evidence leading to a lot of convictions including my own bruh so they supposedly have some evidence uh surveillance footage of the night that we you know killed percy so we are actually finna go ahead and see if we can retrieve that um i'm not too far away. oh no actually yes right here all right y'all so we finna go ahead and park let me see where should we park i guess we'll park right here uh let me back up a little bit <laughs> Look, boy, that boy look like an assassin. I got the gloves on and everything, man. We finna go ahead and do our dirt, bro. Uh, so, yeah, we're gonna go up this alley and find a pretty good vantage point uh, to knock off the prosecutor. Let's see. Go to the vantage point. All right, y'all. So, let's go up here real quick. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see, bro. I'm low-key kind of nervous, man, because I know the police response to something like this is gonna be insane, bro. I know it's gonna be insane. All right, it looks like we gotta... Let me see. I think we go up one. Yeah, we go up one more. All right, y'all. That is our. Oh damn, I'm stuck. All right, y'all. This is our vantage point, and that is actually City Hall right there. So the prosecutor is on the way to get in front of the uh, the, dre the judge and produce the evidence that's gonna lead to a lot of convictions, man. So let's see if we can put a stop to that. All right, here we go. Wait for the prosecutor to reach City Hall. Uh, all right, y'all. <laughs> I'm low key, hella nervous, man. 
but we got our rifle i'm gonna go ahead and stand back here until the prosecutor becomes close uh closer that way we don't blow our cover oh damn he's flying look at the map that nigga, that nigga flying bruh all right here we go i think i got eyes on him uh, i'm pretty sure he's one of the what 14 black cars right there i don't know why so many black cars in one area there go another one all right let's see y'all uh, i look hella suspicious like <laughs> Assassin's Creed. All right, y'all. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, man. Wait. I should knock him off before. Nah, cause I gotta get the evidence. I was gonna say I should not. That would be legendary if we hit him while he's sitting in the car, bro. That would be legendary. All right, here we go. Here we go. I don't know which car he's in, but I'm sure. Let me see. All right, he's right there. Oh, he in a hurry, bro. He in a hurry to convict some niggas. Is he black? I think he's black himself. That's a damn. Shame! Knocked him down, bruh. Knocked him down. All right, y'all. We gotta go collect the evidence. Oh, I thought, <laughs> bro. I thought I was gonna go flying off that thing. All right, y'all. We gotta go collect the evidence real quick. Surprisingly, no police have came yet. I am not complaining. Oh, get on the, get on the thing. Okay, there we go. Come on. All right, y'all. We gotta go collect this evidence real quick. This was actually easier than I expected, man. We ain't even got no police response or nothing. Let me take my pistol out just in case anybody tries anything. I feel like I'm finna get hit by a car. <laughs> Knocked them down, bro, in front of the steps, man. Savage. Yes, sir. All right, y'all, looks like we got two stars, man. We did buddy dirty. Oh, jeez, the police are coming. Um, <laughs> I said like I'm surprised and shit. Let me go ahead and send some shots at them to keep them up off me. Listen, man, I ain't got nothing to lose, bruh. I, oh! Reload, reload! Come on, come on, come on! I ain't got nothing to lose no more, y'all. They already after me for murders. Uh-oh. Alright, let's go, y'all. We got three stars. They up on me. Don't worry about nothing, though. Y'all know, know what time it is, man. Stop playing. I don't, when, when, when I, oh, shit. I'm talking shit for the grass, bruh. Oh, listen, man, when I get in the car, man, all my worries is, I don't worry about nothing, man. I, I keep trying to tell y'all I am the best driver that has ever played this game, but y'all don't seem to understand. Y'all don't seem to want to believe me. Come on, man. Who, who? <laughs> oh, goddamn. <laughs> Let me shut up, man. Oh god! <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm trying to. Damn, bro. See, yeah, now, now the only reason I'm the only reason I'm crashing, bro, is because uh, y'all hating on me. Fuck <laughs> it, I don't know, bro. <laughs> we finna go ahead and lose these boys real quick, man. No worries, no worries. Right, I'm finna get serious and lose these boys. Oh, I'm up out of here. Oh, I'm up out of here. Stop playing. Stop playing. Stop playing. <laughs> Luckily, it ain't a lot of traffic. I don't know why normally the streets be packed, but <laughs> I ain't complaining. The only thing I'd be worried about is that chopper, for real, for real. And I think I may have just lost him, y'all. I, I should go to the pay and spray, bruh. I wonder, is that still what it's called on here? The pay and spray? I remember Vice City, bruh. Tell me Vice City was not a classic, man. <laughs> All right, y'all. Hey, I, I might as well just keep straight. We can go ahead and go back out of town, man. We can go ahead and get up out of town, bruh. It ain't no use in playing. Oh, we got one of them coming down to the right. We finna lose him real quick. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Where you going, where you going? Come on, man. Do your dirt. All right, all right, all right. I think we lost him. I think we lost him, y'all. All right, y'all, we ended up losing the police, man. So now I'm actually headed back to where I came from to go see my baby now nah, i'm playing <laughs> i ain't even finna lay no hands on her man after seeing that damn tiger i am cool bro but yeah we are actually on our way back um we did go ahead and gain that evidence retrieve that evidence so we will go ahead and destroy that as soon as we get back i should feed it to that <laughs> feed it to that big ass tiger but uh yeah man i'm actually go ahead and end the episode right here guys thank you so much for all the love and support man like for real it is unreal how much y'all staying down with me i really really appreciate it i'm trying to be more consistent i'm trying to do these daily uploads i'm trying to do my best I i'm finna be more disciplined with myself to you know flood y'all with more quality content so just stay down with me and again i love y'all so much thank you so much smack that subscribe button 
and I'm on to the next one.